all right guys we're back with the world's fastest 118 scale project again we got our bezgar hm181 we got a new 4.5 turn 7620 kv censured 3650 we got 81 miles an hour before with a 2845 5900 kv we got 12 satellites there we go we're going to run on 2S this first time. I forgot to put my battery strap on. Do that real quick. I tried running this on 3S before. One time. With this new motor. And. The place I tried to run it at. Just wasn't. I guess really a good place to try. That day. Because. It more or less was a miserable fail. Now, I'm hoping we can try this 2S and see what we can get. So, I did put a little light bar on it for at night and a tail light in case we ever have to run at dark. But, give me a second and I will get us going so yeah, it's all a really tight fit I used to have two batteries that hung off both sides but I wanted to cut out some weight if possible so I converted back down to a single battery instead of running two at once Our fans going nuts in there. All right, so there's that. We're we'll gonna go ahead and hit track and start. We still got signal, and we'll go from there. I gotta change the settings in the car. Maybe I might be set up already. I'm gonna have to make sure it's running straight. Looks like it's running off to the right a little bit. There's a car coming behind me. That thing runs so smooth. It's way down there. I want to try to get it to run straight before we run it. Just because this, this car is so powerful it's ridiculous. Waiting on traffic. Still more cars coming. This one's moving a little bit faster. Hopefully they'll go by real quick. And then we can get on with this. Charles goes on way too high. It seems like it's running pretty good now. I don't want to take the top off the body or body battery. It looks like it's running about the best it's probably gonna get. I'm gonna turn the gyroscope back down, it's too much. We'll try to get it down the road. See what we can do with this. Maybe. Now it seems like we're pulling to the right. Or left, I mean.
right, I'm gonna pull it off the side of the road for a second. I know you guys probably can't see it, but there's another car coming behind us. And then we'll try to see if we can what we can do, guys. And pray the Lord that we can have a good pass and see this beautiful day we got going here. It's nice and warm. Now I got a car coming from the other direction. Two cars. Nope, one. Oh, I think after this van that's coming this way, we should be good. Pray to God they don't just accidentally run over a car randomly. You know. Get off to the side of the road a little bit. All right. Is that car coming this way? Damn it. Well, here comes another car, and there comes another car, and I guess I'm going to stop the video for now because we're literally going to be waiting for traffic, so I'll start it once I can. Alright, got it. It looks okay. I guess I'm going to try to drive it from here. I don't think I'm going to get a drive-by. I can't focus on keeping the car straight enough. With the traffic and shit so we'll see if we can top it out maybe now it's back to pulling one way now it's back to pulling the other way you got to be kidding me every time i make an adjustment it just goes the other direction Well, like always, there's another car coming. I'm gonna have like 10 videos of just shutting this off, trying to get the car ready. I swear. We're trying to walk right down here. Maybe we can get somewhat of a drive by. on it rolled again damn it dude i cannot keep it from fucking it's it's all over the place for real and i got no clue i got no clue i'm about done already i'm about to give up i, I don't know why it is so fucking hard to steer this thing i've done 81 miles an hour with this car I just tried five different times to go by and I can't even keep the car straight. The fucking gyroscope isn't helping with anything because the car keeps wanting to pull a different direction. I'm wondering if that front splitter is just dragging the fucking ground at some point. But it don't matter anyways because apparently everything just got ripped off and destroyed man I, I i just i don't know i don't know what to do i have no clue i'm gonna break that off there for now I guess I'm going to try to shove this fucking light up in here. Everything still works. It just, it literally, I can't fucking get the damn car to drive straight. The fucking steering circle is fast enough. A big reason I know what it is, it's got a little wobble right here. You see it? And the wheels point outward. 
and it makes the car turn sharper like you were racing but they need to be straight not pointing outward <sighs> let's see if we can try it like this Nobody's going or coming, whatever you want to call it. So you can keep it in the other lane. That was not full throttle, but it was pretty close. I would say it's like three quarter to, and I rolled the car over and it's back on its wheels. And I know you guys can't see. I'm going to try to bring it back by. Full throttle. That's pretty smooth for 2S. Oh, 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 oh. That's crazy. That's crazy how much it rolls. So I feel like the front splitter was fucking the car up really bad. The rear splitter keeps it from wheeling, so I'm going to have to try to put that back on. We did hit full throttle. Well, let me just, you know, drive the car with other shit. We hit track, or stop, I mean. Read. 72 miles an hour on 2S. That's pretty damn good. That's crazy. That's after all that fucking around and not being able to keep it on the road. This poor car is... It's this poor car, I swear, is just on its last limits. I've, I've done so much to possibly try to make this car be able to do 100. It's not, I don't know, it's not really the car's fault. It's just been abused so much since I've had it trying to push it far the cool part is it's got a 36 tooth pinion and a 52 tooth spur gear there's no fan on the motor and the motor's barely even warm but you can see where the wings have kind of got scuffed up some i was going to try to run 3s but without this splitter in the rear i don't believe it's going to hold up and i guess we're done with this shit I'm going to have to find some a place to put some sticky weights in the front or something to keep the front end down. But that's all we're going to do for now. 72 miles an hour though on 2S. That's crazy. You guys are going to...